China has achieved a significant milestone in space technology with the successful deployment of Appstar 6E, its first all-electric propulsion telecommunications satellite. This advancement not only showcases China's growing capabilities in satellite engineering, but also promises to enhance broadband communication services across Southeast Asia. In this video, we'll explore the innovative technologies behind Appstar 6E, its journey from launch to orbit, and the broader implications of this achievement for global satellite communications. Appstar 6E is a groundbreaking achievement in satellite technology, primarily due to its advanced electric propulsion system. This cutting-edge satellite, developed by the China Academy of Space Technology CAST, is based on the DFH-3E satellite platform. The DFH-3E platform is specifically designed for high-performance geostationary satellites, allowing for advanced communication capabilities and efficient operations. With a planned operational lifespan of 15 years, Appstar 6E is engineered to deliver consistent and reliable performance over its extended mission duration. What sets Appstar 6E apart is its electric propulsion system, a major departure from traditional chemical propulsion. Electric propulsion offers significant advantages it requires substantially less fuel, reducing launch mass and cost while allowing for a larger payload. This means that Appstar 6E can dedicate more of its mass to powerful communication equipment, enhancing its ability to deliver high-speed broadband services. The satellite features 25 Ku-band user beams and 3 Ka-band gateway beams, collectively providing an impressive throughput of approximately 30 GBPs. This high capacity is designed to serve densely populated and underserved regions, particularly in Southeast Asia. The adoption of electric propulsion not only optimizes fuel efficiency, but also underscores a shift toward more sustainable and cost-effective space technologies. This innovation aligns with global trends in satellite design, where efficiency and affordability are becoming key priorities. For China, Appstar 6E represents a significant milestone as its first satellite to operate solely with electric propulsion. This technological leap places China at the forefront of satellite innovation, enabling more advanced and efficient telecommunications infrastructure. The satellite's geostationary positioning at 134 degree east allows it to maintain a fixed location relative to the Earth's surface. This orbit is ideal for telecommunications, as it provides continuous coverage over a specific region. By leveraging this position and its advanced capabilities, Appstar 6E stands as a testament to China's growing expertise in satellite engineering and its ability to deliver high-quality communication services on a global scale. Appstar 6E's journey began with its launch on January 13, 2023, aboard a Long March 2C carrier rocket from the Yexichang Satellite Launch Center in Sichuan Province. The Long March 2C, known for its reliability, was an apt choice for deploying this advanced satellite. After the initial launch phase, Appstar 6E separated from its propulsion module and commenced its orbit-raising mission using its state-of-the-art electric propulsion system. This marked a significant milestone in China's space program, as it was the first time a Chinese satellite utilized electric propulsion for orbit transfer. The orbit-raising process a critical phase for any geostationary satellite, took approximately 514 days to complete. During this period, the satellite gradually ascended to its final geostationary orbit at an altitude of about 35,786 kilometers. The use of electric propulsion for this process underscores the satellite's innovative design. Unlike traditional chemical propulsion systems that achieve orbit transfer quickly, but at the cost of high fuel consumption, electric propulsion is far more efficient. It uses electric power to accelerate ions, providing a steady but highly efficient thrust. This approach extends the time required to reach geostationary orbit, but significantly reduces the satellite's overall launch mass and operational costs. Appstar 6E's successful orbit transfer also demonstrates the reliability and precision of its electric propulsion technology. By autonomously navigating to its designated orbital slot, the satellite showcased the maturity of China's satellite technology and its readiness to compete on a global scale. The satellite's placement at 134 degree east longitude is a strategic choice, as it offers optimal coverage for its target regions in Southeast Asia. 
This innovative deployment strategy sets a precedent for future satellite launches. By leveraging electric propulsion, satellite operators can reduce costs while enhancing payload capacity, making space more accessible and economically viable. For China, the successful deployment of AppStar 6E is not just a technological achievement, but also a statement of its growing capabilities in the global space industry. It highlights the country's commitment to innovation and its ability to execute complex space missions with precision. AppStar 6E's operation is a significant leap forward in global telecommunications, particularly for underserved regions in Southeast Asia. Managed by Hong Kong-based AppStar Alliance Satcom Limited, the satellite is designed to provide high-throughput broadband communication services with a specific focus on Indonesia. This capability is especially critical in areas where traditional internet infrastructure is limited or non-existent. By delivering affordable and reliable connectivity, AppStar 6E addresses the digital divide and empowers communities through enhanced access to information, economic opportunities, and vital services. The satellite's high-throughput design is tailored to meet the growing demand for broadband services in densely populated regions. With its 25 KU band user beams and 3 KA band gateway beams, AppStar 6E can handle a communication throughput of up to 30 GBPs. This capacity enables the delivery of high-speed internet, supporting applications such as remote education, telemedicine, e-commerce, and smart technologies. For Indonesia and neighboring countries, this translates to improved connectivity, fostering economic growth, innovation, and social inclusion. Beyond its regional impact, AppStar 6E represents a broader shift in satellite technology and strategy. Its reliance on electric propulsion underscores a trend toward more sustainable and cost-effective solutions in the space industry. By reducing the reliance on chemical propulsion, electric systems lower operational costs, enhance fuel efficiency, and minimize environmental impact, aligning with global efforts to make space exploration and utilization more sustainable. For China, the successful operation of AppStar 6E solidifies its position as a leader in satellite technology. It demonstrates the country's ability to deliver state-of-the-art telecommunications infrastructure while competing with global players like the United States and Europe. Moreover, this success highlights the strategic importance of space in advancing national interests, from economic development to technological innovation, and strengthening international partnerships in satellite communications. AppStar 6E also sets a precedent for future satellite missions, emphasizing the importance of efficiency and innovation in satellite design and operation. As more countries and organizations adopt similar technologies, the global satellite industry is poised for a new era of accessibility and affordability. For end users, this means faster internet speeds, better connectivity, and a more inclusive digital future. AppStar 6E is not just a technological achievement, but a symbol of how innovation can transform global communication, enrich lives, and drive progress on a global scale. AppStar 6E's successful deployment marks a significant advancement in satellite technology highlighting the benefits of electric propulsion and its potential to revolutionize space operations. By providing enhanced broadband services to Southeast Asia, the satellite plays a crucial role in promoting digital inclusion and economic growth. China's accomplishment with AppStar 6E sets a new standard in the satellite industry, paving the way for more efficient and cost-effective space missions in the future. Thank you for watching. If you enjoyed this video, please like, share, and subscribe for more updates on space exploration and scientific discoveries.